What is up juice crew how are y'all doing i am going to tell y'all about this last two weeks of this med trim meal plan that i was on keyword was was <laughs> on um the first week um, as y'all know, was a was just basically shakes, drinks, um, protein bars, protein shakes, protein drinks, and um, protein bars with um, vitamins. So that was week one, and from week one, I lost 11 pounds. So week two, I was able to get food, as I told y'all. Um, this is some of the foods. I was able to get is cereal, granola. Oatmeal, scrambled eggs, almonds, pancakes, that's worth the time. Entree and soups is entree, quick fix, pasta, and sauce, and then just soup. Sweet snacks include puffs, cookies, puddings, bar, gelatin desserts, and brownies. Savory snacks include something called zippers, brown bread, toast, and then some more snacks like Oreos, Twizzlers, Pop-Tarts, 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 Pop-T
turkey meats like <sighs> I, I just oh my gosh I can't believe it I I'm my thing is if that's what I have to eat to lose weight like that type of food I understand protein high protein low carbs I didn't I didn't eat bread and to this day right now I haven't ate bread or cheese or pasta or anything like that so the carbs part is okay for me But it, it just was like, I got this tomato soup, which, which was disgusting. <laughs> it, it, it wouldn't even matter how much seasoning I would put in, put in there, you know. She said I could add salt and pepper to it, but no matter what you put in there, it still, it had a weird after aftertaste to it. And I just, something it, it couldn't. So that was the soup I would, uh, soup I would eat for lunch. Um, or this broccoli I would eat. Um, yeah. Or this creamy pasta. Why do I have so many of these boxes? Cause I think I only had two of these. And then there was another soup I had that was good. This was good.
to show how the food was basically and um that that was good the broccoli i i started putting real broccoli with this broccoli that's what made this taste good i added cauliflower or like um not even a tablespoon of salsa i would add to this like a, like i said i'll show y'all in a in my video because i was uh, going day by day but yeah the soups it's like you could taste the protein like i don't want to taste the protein i don't want to taste the goodness i want to just eat it i don't want to you know it was a real bad aftertaste to it so i just couldn't i couldn't i couldn't i couldn't but i did i finished the i finished my two weeks um and yeah This is tomato soup, Italian tomato soup. <sighs> this is my lunch for today. Like, oh my God, look how this shit looks, y'all. I don't think this is tomatoes. I think this is, I don't know. <laughs> what the hell, food coloring and whey? I don't know, however they made it get thick with some seasoning in there. I think this is just food coloring because it doesn't really have a taste to it. I should have showed y'all when it came out the microwave, it had like this white crust. You see those little dots and stuff? It was like a crust on top of it that I just <sighs> mixed together. But what I'm about to add to it is some um, salsa. Okay, I'm back. My battery died. I don't know if I mentioned that. But anyway, so breakfast again was protein pancake, eggs, um, and then lunch. Oh, I didn't get to show y'all my savory, I mean my sweet snacks. That's where all these boxes came from. So I'm trying to think, where did all these boxes come from? She also just, because I, I got my sweet snacks she just added to like a the box or something because it was like two broccolis in here and two or three something in here and something like that so she just added my uh snack cookies and wafer to them and the chips again i'm gonna show y'all that because um i didn't have a box for them but i kept them in the refrigerator and I return the chips. Those protein chips were disgusting. And it was so many of them. Like, it's like, I couldn't even, I tried to do like a handful at a time to chew it down and swallow it, but the aftertaste, that, that um, protein taste, that chalky, make you wanna gag, that's what I was I was getting. So I was like, ooh, this is not gonna work. Not for two, not for a whole week. The first day I tried it, uh, yeah, that following day, I had to go back and return those and get a uh, protein shot. So I think again I told y'all that. Hey, what is up, Juice Crew? How are y'all doing on this? Um okay, <laughs> weather. Uh, today is Thursday, the eighth. I'm um, on my second week today. I forgot to come on here earlier when I was eating because um, the AT&T people were coming. <sighs> and I still ain't got my service, but that's not neither here nor there. I'll tell y'all about that another time. But anyway, so for breakfast, I was able to eat a pancake and my battery wants to die. So I'm trying to talk until my battery dies. I was able to eat one chocolate chip pancake and drink my drink, but for some reason, I read the ingredients wrong. Not the ingredients, the instructions, instructions about how much water to put in my pancake mix and it just, whatever. Then I tried to put it in the, in the microwave to make it like a muffin, no. <laughs> and then whatever was left, I put it inside of my, um, 
little waffle iron and y'all that was the most struggle pancake waffle <laughs> muffin oh my gosh it was horrible but i ate it because that's the only food i was going to eat for the morning time and my drink and pills but now i'm on to these little snackities here this is my midday savory snack these are some little corn not corn protein chip thing let me tell you this way that's like that it's so many of them oh my god and they taste all right but they don't taste uh, that good so it's just so many of them i had to come here and tell y'all that but this is week two week one was good and yeah i'm excited <laughs> all right y'all let me go for this battery down me hey 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 what's up good people so what's next for me to eat is my mid morning snack even though it's like two o'clock <laughs> because i you know wake up kind of late uh my mid morning snack is yeah um so my mid morning snack is something a sweet snack or a savory snack right here okay so from my sweet snack i can get well, I don't have the box to it because she let me mix and match. Mix and match some things up. So I can either eat this chocolate chip cookie. This is um, like a um, wafer bar, a chocolate, chocolate wafer bar. Or I can drink this protein shake, this protein single shot here. Because um, yesterday when I was talking to y'all, I was telling y'all, I don't know why I said because, but um, yesterday I was eating these these here, these little zing, zickers, zipper chips, zipper snacks. This is Chipotle barbecue. Y'all, these things are so disgusting. <laughs> they look like this. I showed y'all yesterday. These things are, oh my gosh. I had to take them back to the doctor and I told her no, cause I had seven. You're supposed to get um, 14. So, you know, um, two a day. I don't know how it's supposed to go, but anyways, I got 14. So I had seven bags of the chips and then four cookies and three wafers. So when I return, the chips there wasn't anything else i could get but the protein um shot so i got that i can either take the protein shot or eat something sweet and i think i am going to um eat something sweet um i ate the protein i ate the wafer last night well my mid my mid afternoon snack that was what i i ate and i like the wafer so i want to try the cookie and i've already tried this shot because when i took the chips back she let me taste it and then you know i just have to drink the whole thing but yeah i think i'm going to eat this cookie for my snack and then i eat every three hours it's between two to three hours. I go three hours because two hours, that's just too much. I can't be doing all of that. And then eating every two hours, um, I, since I stay up so late, um, that's how it looks. It looks like a protein cookie. You know how those protein cookies look. Yeah. I'll talk about cooking.
oh, I didn't get, I didn't tell y'all the dinner part. The dinner entrees were delicious though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, uh, and you know, at night my dinner was, um, how many? Ooh, damn, I didn't drop everything. I think I had got two of these, which was, this is good. The beef stroganoff was good. Um, so three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, yeah. So I got two of two of something. I think I got two of these to so make seven. This was delicious. Oh, I love enchiladas. Ooh, enchiladas was good. The vegetable lasagna was good. And turkey chili is also what I got. And this was good. So I got three of these, one of one of each of these, you know, just a regular meal. And then I got two of these, two of these and two of these to make seven. Um, so the dinner part was good. The Do what the instructions say. Oops, it's up here, it says zip to open. That's some stuff I got free from Whole Foods. This is the chicken enchilada verde. Um, microwave. Peel back. Microwave on high for a minute. And then back on high for a minute. So I'm just gonna put it on there for two minutes. Because it's telling me rotate a quarter turn and heat again for a half to another minute. But my um, my microwave rotates on its own, so I'll just put it in there for well, that's how it looks. It smells like enchiladas, though. So. but I don't really have any good news on the weight loss part because uh, I have no idea where my paper went, but I didn't lose any weight. I kept the same weight. I, I lost a little bit of inches, not inches, a little bit like point, if it was 0.6, then it was 0.5. So I didn't really lose much of anything. And then she was telling me, um, my two weeks ended on the 14th of, july june july um and when i went in there she was asking me you know how was my bowel movements and things like that and i'm thinking um i haven't had one in like days i, I couldn't even remember the last time i had a bowel movement and she was like well that's the reason why you haven't lost any weight you back it up you're backed up um, so she was supposed to be giving me some fiber to help move things along, but um, I guess after I said that I wasn't doing the third week or getting food for the third week, um, I don't know if she, she didn't seem like she had an attitude, but 
um, she just kind of like, mm, okay, whatever. She didn't give me anything for my, for to help me, you know, poop. So, you know, I went to my old remedies and, you know, what makes my stomach hurt? Dairy. <laughs> What's going to help me, you know, move things faster. So, um, I didn't really lose any weight this uh, second week and the third week again I can't see myself paying that much for this type of food when I've tried protein food before yes it still tastes like protein I'm not saying that it's not gonna taste like protein but it's it, it's still it tastes better and it still had, you know, the calories and the sugar and, and things like that that's similar to this. So I know there's food out there that you can eat that you don't have to eat like how I was eating. And why I also ultimately just didn't continue with the program is my eating habit. Um, I'm supposed to eat two to three times a day, two to three, no, eat every two to three hours. I would set my alarm for three hours. So when I wake up, it's normally around 10 or 11. So I set my alarm. Once I wake up three hours later, then that's what I'm eating. So when I wake up, I make sure um, within that time, I'm taking my medicine or I'm eating. Uh, well, I'm taking my vitamins and I'm eating breakfast. So from 10 to whatever three hours later it is, and then that's my mid-morning, then that's when I eat my cookie or my wafer or my chips or something like that. So that's how it was going. But I would end up going longer than three hours. Like I, I forget that I'm supposed to eat. Um, my alarm will go off. I click it to restart it for the next three hours and just tell myself, you know, if I'm doing something or if I'm not hungry, it's like, okay, well, get up in 30 minutes. Then you could just add 30 minutes to the next three hours. So then, you know, you'll still be on track. Just keep it a mental note that, you know, you didn't start eating till 30 minutes after the three hours started. But then it went from 30 minutes to an hour. And then I haven't ate, I haven't eaten in four or five hours and it's like oh shit i'm supposed to eat already or you know i'm supposed to do this already and because i don't know because i was eating every two to three hours i think it was keeping me full to where i didn't need to eat the next three hours but you supposed to eat every two to three hours and it was just i couldn't keep up even with the three hours because i don't eat like that you know what I'm saying? Like the snacking, all that's good. Cause I'm good at snacking, but um, it's eating. It's like, I don't even think about it. It's like, I'm so used to, you know, when I hear my stomach growling, okay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Okay, I drink some water or I just don't even listen to it because I'm, I'm hungry, but I'm not starving. I'm like, I'm not about to die to eat you know how that feels when your stomach is touching your back and you about to eat this horse you know what i'm saying alive but you know i wasn't hungry like that like i could feel my stomach growling and i was like you know my three hours ain't up but then i forget that you didn't even eat that last three hours so you you missed the last three hours and you about to miss this next three hours because you're not and then the food wasn't good like I was saying like my how I eat I still eat like that now like I can go the whole day without eating and then realize at 8 or 9 o'clock you haven't ate anything today you know you took your medicine and you drank a protein drink but other than that you haven't really ate anything so that's what I'm about battling with now is just eating and eating consistently 
Um, but, you know, I take what I learned from this experience and um, put it towards, you know, future. Um, like I was saying, I've tried this because I've never done anything like this before. I never paid to buy food or anything like that. So I wanted to see how it was gonna be and, you know, things like that. And um, I won't say I wasted the money, it was, like I said, a good experience. It helped jump start my body to, you know, exercising and eating and stuff like that. And, you know, it's just, it's not, um, I didn't do anything in vain, I guess that's what I'm trying to say. It, it helped me jump start stuff. So, yeah, that's the end of Metrum. And, <laughs> I'm not gonna say my uh, weight loss journey or my lifestyle journey or whatever journey this is um, is ending because like I say, it actually helped jumpstart things. Um, I'm thinking more um, more high, high in protein, less in carbs. I'm not really counting calories or anything like that. I'm looking at, I, I had already was looking at sodium I know sodium is salt, it is high. <laughs> you know, if I see a thousand uh, milligrams of sodium, that's not something I'm gonna be eating. That that or that is the whole, that meal will be for my entire day. <laughs> so, you know, I know how to calculate my sodium and my um, carbohydrates and cholesterol, not cholesterol, calories and stuff like that so it's it's all good but anyways thank you good people for watching hope y'all enjoyed i hope y'all enjoyed the little two weeks that i was on um this plan and hopefully it helped uh jump start someone else's or one of y'all's um lifestyle change weight loss goals or diet goals or whatever whatever but okay, let me let y'all go. I'll talk to you good people later. Oh, no, that's what I was gonna say. <laughs>